Hello, hello, my beautiful queens. How are you all going today? I hope you're having a very positive week, guys, and getting everything you want. Everything. Yep, everything. Today's video, guys, I created this awesome bold red lip with a nice nudy eye. I mean, I love this look. It looks so good when you wear black and white. It looks great when you wear black. It looks great when you wear white. And it just looks great overall. It even looks great when you're wearing hoodies and jeans. It really does. It just oomps up the look. It just makes you look, you know, chic, beautiful, everything. Check out that colour. Natasha Denona's Nina Rouge lipstick, guys. One of my faves. I love this lipstick. It just, it stays. It stays for hours, you know. It's just beautiful. And a nice nudy look using the new By Reader Remembrance palette, guys. Sorry for the smudges. But, uh, yeah, I love this look and you will too. So if you want to see how I created this super, super easy, hardly any product look, Keep on watching. It will uplift you. Mwah! Okay, my gorgeous queens, let's hit this beautiful look, eh? I've already done my base and everything like that. Base is skin, right? And it was just a light application of the beautiful NARS Sheer Glow Foundation, guys. This is another great, reliable foundation. Besides my Dior ones, oh, my NARS ones, I run to them all the time. This is a lovely one. The NARS Sheer Glow, guys, it's medium coverage but gives you this awesome beautiful glowy look all day and it stays guys it doesn't cake up doesn't look fake i get so many compliments when i wear this one so i'm nearly out so i'm gonna have to get another one now today's look guys is going to be a beautiful red red bold lip and i think a beautiful red bold lip goes so well when you're wearing black or black and white or white by itself something like that and it just looks stunning so the eyes need to be very neutral it has to be all about the red lip and i will show you exactly what i mean guys i just need a bit of powder um i want to go with my beautiful nars the well it's not new okay but it's it's pretty new it's out this year and it's a matte perfecting powder okay it's really beautiful at blurring guys and i use this all the time i don't want a pink powder today i'll use this one so i've got that color there which is sure so it's more closer to my skin tone and we're just going to pop a bit under the eyes eh i haven't done any concealer or anything i'm not going to i've got that nars powder just under the eyes there and it's so blurring guys it's really 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 nice i love it and i've also got the lighter shade as well if i want a more brighter eye like i said today's look is going to be very very fast i have got my hands on the new by rito remembrance palette oh my gosh the first palette i can't remember what it was it's in my drawers i should have bought it out but you know it's a fast video guys and i have to get this shit ready you know in advance but it's the By Rito Remembrance palette. It's so beautiful. You could call this luxury, okay? It's expensive, but let's test it out. The first palette from them. Oh my goodness. Beautiful and stunning. I love the packaging. Look at that. It just comes in a little sleevey thing like that. And then it's a kind of mirror. Full on, nice weighted palette. It's just beautiful. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a woman. But it's stunning. I really wanted to try it because of the colours. So these are the gorgeous colours here, guys. Look how beautiful those are. Look at them. They're right up my alley. <laughs> they truly, truly are. Get closer. These are beautiful. I mean, who wouldn't love this palette, right? I'll have everything linked in my description box anyway, guys, about this palette. And I'm sorry, I don't like doing swatches. Maybe I will later on, but, you know. Ugh, isn't that beautiful? We're going to use that today on the eyes, so let's get into it. So we're going to go light, guys. It's going to be all about the bold red lip, okay? So that's what the focus is going to be. So if you have a really heavy, dark, you know, smoky eyed look like I love doing, <laughs> it's just going to look very 
it's just not going to come together properly it's not going to look classy or it's not going to look chic you know so that's what we want a nice chic look a lot of metallics in here guys a lot of mattes which is beautiful so we're going to go with this one here that one right there it's a nice light matty one and i'm going to put that in the crease oh they feel good they feel good look at that oh i love it it's got a mirror let's get it on Nice and light, wow. It's very close to my natural skin tone actually. What am I gonna do? Because I'm gonna put that color that we just put in the crease all over the lid, okay? Because that is a gorgeous color. And it's light enough to be a one and done. It ends out lovely, what a lovely palette. As I said guys, pricey. But you know, if you if you can afford these kind of things, guys, go for it. Otherwise, I have other options here, which is my beautiful Jaclyn Hill palette. My gosh, 18 bucks off Morphe, guys. Like I said, if I only had one palette, it would be this one. Um, a little bit more Makeup by Mario is another good one. Like the Jaclyn one a bit more, though. And if you want to go even more expensive than this one, uh, Natasha Denoman. Natasha Denona Bieber, but you will not be disappointed, honestly. Not be disappointed buying any of your damn palettes. Beautiful. So we're going to go for this one here. That one. And we're going to put that in the crease because it's a little bit darker and it will contour that eye a little bit more, eh? Give it a go anyway. What is the eye contour? Flick it out. And then obviously the lighter at the bottom. Lovely, lovely shadows, guys. See what I mean? So we're going to go back to that light one we used here, the matte. So a little bit dusty. That's okay. Just pat, pat, pat that everywhere and kind of meld it into that creasy colour. See that? Beautiful. I will show you the power of this. <laughs> I will show you the power of this palette in another video. Um, I do want to put on a shimmer though. My eyes are gravitating to these bloody silvers, but you know that might take it all away. I don't want to be boring, so I am going to add on a bit of a just something inside that middle part as a shimmer. So I'm going to go for this one here. It looks really nice. It's a kind of nudie brown. Pick up one of those hard brushes and we're just going to pop a bit of this in the middle. Oh, that's nice. Yes. Yes, that's not going to be too overboard. Just a little bit in the middle and bring it up as well, guys. If you've got hooded eyes, bring the damn shadow up. Don't be scared. I mean, I know I used to always just keep it down here where my hooded aging eyes are but now I know bring it up a bit you know you want to see it who cares just pop that oh that's beautiful look it's just a glimmer of oh beautiful nudiness look at that it just added a beautiful little nudie sheen get that brush and we're just going to you know meld everything together and that's it. Can you see that beautiful nudie sheen? Urgh. Bottom lash shine, guys, it's a total must. Um, I like to hit a darker for my bottom lash line, I just do. Who is going to be the winner? I'm going to try this one here at the end, okay? Because it's a matte. Just like that. Actually, I'm not looking too good today, guys. Honestly, um, I'm looking in my mirror and I've got, yeah. It's not a good makeup day for me. So hopefully, hopefully this look kind of changes its ass around. Get your sponge and just clean up those edges. It's okay not to have a good makeup day, guys. It, it happens all the time. 
really does. Now I'm gonna go with my beautiful Charlotte Tilbury huge massive beautiful bronzer here which I haven't used in a while and I actually pulled her out the other day. Put a bit here. You need bronzer guys, you really do. Um, you know, not on the weekends if you don't want to. Of course I'm talking about if you're going anywhere, if you're going to work. Or, this is a lovely work look by the way and not too much, you know, not too much. I don't even need to bring it down with my beauty blender today. So these are the beautiful Natasha Nona red lippies that came out this year. I need a rouge lipstick and the pencil. Now I got both shades. She only sold two shades. This is a dark one and there's a more orangey, you know, orangey red. I love this one, the true one. This is more of a blood red. Blue blue red I'd say. Now with these guys it is good to put on a lip liner because it's red. So I also got her lip liner as well. These are amazing. They stay like a dream guys. Honestly you will not be disappointed. Honestly you will not be disappointed if you pick these up. They're beautiful lip lippies. Again you know again but pricey. Other ones that I can recommend Hey, I just got this one in from um, House Labs, Le Monster. These Le Monster crowns are really, really nice. Heaps, heaps of different ones. NYX, you know, but today I want to use this one. I suck at putting on a lip pencil. <laughs> I actually like doing it after. My lips are dry. Other than that. And, you know, don't be afraid to fill it in a bit. You don't have to. If you want. Ah! I really suck at putting on lip liner. My edges always go all wrong. Okay, let's put on this beautiful Need a Rouge lippy. Is this the right colour? <laughs> oh my gosh, look at that. My gosh, doesn't that change everything guys? Honestly, look at it. It just really changes the whole lot. I look a bit more sophisticated. I will straighten up my useless lip liner lines. <laughs> I am so bad at putting on lip liner, especially red. Red is really hard to achieve, like, you know. But just do your best. But who cares if it's a bit wonky, you know. I don't want to touch anymore. I might pick it up. <laughs> but look at that, guys. What do you think? I love it. Let's put on a bit of blush because we never did that. I'm going to use my beautiful Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Blush. Just quickly get that on real fast. A little bit of pink, not too much, remember? I don't want to be clowning our asses off over here, guys. Just a tad, you know, just a tad. I love to put on my eyes. And don't forget we're going to put setting spray on, so that's perfect. I do want to put eyeliner on because that is very necessary for my hooded eyes. So now, waterproof 24 hour pencil guys, never ever 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 runs. And another thing too um, you can do is just leave the eyeliner out. The more nudier the eyes look, the better actually. But I enjoy, I find that if I don't have any eyeliner on, I look at myself during the day and I think, oh gosh, there's something missing, you know. Charlotte. Let's just push that in a bit. Do you see how amazing that red lip is? Let me back you out. I'll take my hair out and then we can have a good look. I look great. It's all about the red lip. Hold on up. Okay, my gorgeous queens, what do you think of this gorgeous, gorgeous look? Do you know what I mean by having that nudie, you know, nudie ish, beautiful eye and then you've got that bold 
red red lip it just looks so chic can i say french or will they actually attack me online for it <laughs> i just think it looks very very chic it just looks very classy you look really really put together and i always say that in my videos guys if you are feeling not good and you're not looking good or whatever you're just feeling shit chuck on a red bold lip with anything you're wearing hoodies jeans whatever nice nudie eye or just leave the eye completely make sure your eyebrows are done of course and chuck on a red lip and it just takes everything away it just makes you look oh my gosh looks great you know she's got far out wow you know it just does something that bold bold red lip guys the men love it <laughs> my husband loves it so yeah it's a really really nice look look at that nudie eye that we created with this awesome by Rito remembrance palette guys oh i will show you a full look on this and i'll show you the other ones side by side as well later not today we only use three shades but we wanted that this nudie look eh? as i said you can go for the cheaper palettes like the jacqueline one will do the same effect or the makeup by mario because we're only looking at looking for those nudie browns eh matty ones but look at that i love that little shimmer that that by Rito palette gave me but my focus is this beautiful I need a rouge lipstick and lip crayon from Natasha Denona. Man, and honestly guys, these stay hours. When I'm at work guys, they stay for hours. They're amazing, they're beautiful. But I hope you enjoyed this look guys, and yes, please try it out. It was so super fast, wasn't it? You know, it's really, really, really easy guys, and it will uplift you, make you feel confident, and just that red bold lip just, just gives you, you know, a bit of power. <laughs> I love you guys and I hope you guys have a great great day and positivity to all my queens out there. I love you guys. See you on my next one. Mwah.